Before The Rock was known as Franchise Viagra, he was tasked with kicking off a video game and movie franchise based on Spy Hunter. How many creative ways can you kill somebody? <laughs> Now you're asking yourself, Dwayne The Rock Johnson in a video game and movie series, where could this go wrong? Oh, oh right. Spy Hunter Nowhere to Run set out to relaunch the video game series that began in 1983. And while the video game rushed into production, the movie stalled. At this time, John Woo was attached to direct with the writers that brought you Freddy vs. Jason. You can actually see that The Rock is all in on this franchise. I love doing motion capture and work because as a gamer myself, it's great to make sure that, you know, the person who they're playing and who they're depicting is that real person. I love that. Now, for those who aren't familiar with the Spy Hunter series, it actually was intended to be a James Bond racing game back in 1983. But since Midway couldn't acquire the license, they rebranded the game as Spy Hunter and went on to big success. Cutting edge, powerful, exhilarating, and like The Rock, it will be the most electrifying thing coming out this year. The game did receive mixed to poor reviews. A lot of people didn't like the gameplay outside of the vehicles. Now, while the game was panned by critics, the potential movie would suffer a worse fate. It would switch writers and directors for years before ultimately The Rock would leave the project. But I don't know, I think this game got a little bit of a bum rap, because look at that, The Rock's kicking ass in there. Who doesn't want to do that with The Rock? He's handing out rock bottoms like he's in a slobber knocker match. Cars blowing up and turning into a motorcycle. I mean, who doesn't like that? But she's still alive. How the hell is that a success? Got her phone number. <laughs> <laughs> now you have to ask Spy Hunter 2006, did I really think covering this game now was gonna get views? Did I really think it was gonna get me subscribers? What is wrong with my- Now if you're wondering if The Rock even remembers that he was in this project, he did reference it at the 2017 Game Awards. You were in a game too. Yes, okay. I was in a game. Yeah, Spy Hunter, classic Midway game. Dun 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 yeah. dun. 2006. I'm still loving my three out of ten review from Game Informer, by the way. Three out of ten. Okay, Thanks, guys. that's all right. Now, for me, I'm a sucker for any movie video game tie-in, and this was before Mortal Kombat would just throw in 80s action stars in the game. So you got to give them some bonus points for trying that out. Ultimately, The Rock did find his racing movie with the Fast and the Furious, and I don't think he's losing too much sleep over this one. It's never been tested, but now seems as good a time as any to see what it can do. Hey, wings. Nice option. I thought so.